The pauper's funeral by Robert Southey. What, and not one to heath the pious sigh, and one whose sore, swollen, and aching eye for social scenes, for life's endearments fled, should drop a tea and dwell upon the dead? Poor wretched outcast, I will weep for thee, and sore for forlorn humanity. Yes, I will weep, but not that thou art come to the stern sabbath of thy silent tomb. For squalid want, the black scorpion care, heart the fearing fiends, shall never enter there. A store for the ills of a life has known, as for the world's long pilgrim marsh, alone haunted by poverty and war begone, unloved, unfriended, what its journey on. By youth and ignorance and labour past, by an old age of bareness and blast, hard was the fate which, while it doomed to woe, denied the wisdom to support the blow. And robbed of all its energy of our mind, they yet it cast thee on thy fellow kind, abject of thought, the victim of distress, to wander in the world's wide wilderness. Poor outcasts sleep in peace, a wintry storm blows beak no more in thine unsheltered form, the woes are past, or restest in the tomb, a pause and ponder on the days to come.